so today me and Adeline are here to be sharing one of our favorite smoothie slash milkshake recipes. Um, this is something that I grew up with. My mom would make this for us all the time. She called it a licuado. I'm not sure how that translates, but we pretty much just call it a smoothie milkshake. Um, so I am so excited. We are going to be using the Kasori blender and I'm going to link this down below for you guys. It is super nice. We have not had like a nice blender um, pretty much ever. We've always gotten like cheapy blenders and you can definitely tell the difference in this blender we've used it a couple of times and it blends everything so well it mixes everything so well so this blender also comes with a tamper this is pretty much just used if you need to get some air pockets out of the blender to help blend everything better and it also comes with a travel mug which is super awesome because you can make a smoothie pour it in here and you're on the go it also comes with a recipe book full of smoothies and salsas and a bunch of different recipes that you can do like i said today we're going to be doing something that i grew up drinking it's super easy and the kids love it you love it right when mommy makes it yeah Adeline's going to be helping me today. The key features of this blender is the variable speed control. You're able to change the speed according to um, how you want to blend it, low speed or high speed. It is. It has a pulse function, so if you just need to pull something for some salsas or something like that, that is an awesome plus. All right, so Adeline, do you want to tell us what we're going to be using today? So we're going to be using ice, banana, milk and can you lift it yeah and some sugar we try not to add a lot of sugar but the kids like it a little bit sweet so we do add a little bit of sugar you ready mm -hmm. you ready to show them how to make it mm -hmm. yeah so the first thing we're going to do is add the milk so i'm going to add some milk you don't need a ton i kind of just eyeball it let's see so I added a little over a cup of milk, and now Adeline's gonna add a whole banana in there. You put it in there. Now that we've added the banana and the milk, we're gonna add some sugar. Like I said, the kids like things sweet. I know my head's cut off. Um, the kids like things kind of sweet. You don't have to add like a lot of sugar. I'm gonna add um, about almost a tablespoon, um, a little bit less than a tablespoon and that should be more than enough usually the bananas are sweet enough but if they're not super ripe they're not super sweet sometimes we add an egg i'm not adding an egg today but we are adding some ice so addy go ahead and pour the ice in all of it. not all of it maybe like half of it it's probably good okay and now we're gonna blend it up you ready <laughs> So are you ready to try it? Mm -hmm. Yeah? Okay, go ahead and try it. What do you think? Yeah. It's good? Mm -hmm. Yeah? Are you going to share your brother and sister? Mm -hmm. No! So I hope you guys enjoyed this super simple smoothie recipe using the Kasori blender. I'm telling you guys, it's one of the best blenders that we have tried. It just blends the ice so smoothly. It blends everything very, very smoothly. And we really like it. It's really easy to clean and everything. So I'm going to leave that linked down below um, in case you guys are interested. It is going to be on Amazon's Prime Days, which start the 15th. So definitely go check that out. I, like I said, I will leave that link down below, if you guys have any smoothie recipes for us to try, the kids are obsessed with smoothies. They absolutely love them, and it's the one thing that I can get them to drink, eat all the time. So leave me those down below, and I hope you guys try this smoothie. If you do, let me know, and let me know what you think about it. Yeah? All right, so thank you for watching. Thank you for watching. Bye, guys.